So today, I'm going to be doing the two box challenge on every single Call of Duty Zombies game, from World of War all the way to Vanguard. Now, in case you don't know what the two box challenge is, it's pretty straightforward. You basically get two hits of the box, and whatever you get, that's all you can use for the rest of the game. Now, usually I set a total round goal that I have to reach by the end of the video, but boys, as you're about to see, something was out to get me, all right? Whatever you think can go wrong, it went wrong, all right? So be sure to watch the whole video. Also, I'm only 1,000 subs from hitting 20k, which is my goal for the end of the month, so if you guys can help me get to 20k, I would greatly appreciate it. Appreciate it. Also, if we do hit 20k by the end of the month, I do have a big stream plan. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. But yeah, other than that, let's jump right into our first game. Right then, boys. So onto our first game, we have World at War. And now the map I picked is Verrucked because it's the only map that I haven't played yet in one of these videos. So uh, that's my one reason. But it does mean we're going to have a bit more of a challenging time than usual. So let's see how it goes. So this challenge is a, definitely a bit more forgiving than the one box challenge because if we do get a bad gun, we at least have a second attempt. So let's see how it goes. I'm going to allow myself to use the M1911 until we get to the box and then once we hit the box once that, that, that the gun is not allowed anymore then again we will be switching out like as soon as we can hit it again so not too bad boys so I'm, like speed up these zombie spawns but they're actually so slow i actually like dread playing world of war when we do these challenges because just like spawns are just so bad i'm not a personal fan of world of war but i think i'm more into the custom mod inside of it rather than like the base maps but come on boys you guys can speed up you guys don't need to walk this slow also at the time we recording this video the channel had just hit 19k or it's actually insane to me bro like i get giddy thinking about it. you guys don't understand but only one more k boys so we have a little bit over a week to get 1,000 more subscribers and then we're at 20k bro that's my goal for the end of the month like complete see, right now YouTube is going just so well for me and I could not be more happy oh yeah we also just ran out of ammo and we got max ammo bro look how lucky that is bro see, look everything's just going right for me bro let's just take out a zombie I don't know how many points it takes us to get up to the box it's a little bit you know not good to know that was an English sentence yeah zombie are you gonna die bro also someone in the comments on my uh, melee only oh my god I actually just died that is inc I was about to say that they taught me how to actually melee properly and then I just did that that is actually actually criminal but right, i'm just gonna buy me the card 90k and just start picking off heads bro because these guys taking so long also i know i don't usually give myself a second attempt but boys i need content you need content you know let's just let's just have a mutual a treaty here that you know we're gonna allow this one reset as i was trying to say right someone taught me how to like knife properly so pretty much you got like move back could do it there but he told me on my melee only video uh, and i kind of wish i knew it because i feel like i would have gotten a bit further but i mean it was what it is what it is where are these zombies like, what are you spawning over there for i'm kind of annoyed i'm just gonna start opening doors it goes world at war though is we don't get quick revive which is definitely like not good so specifically for World of War, we just need to try and make sure we don't get too unlucky with our weapons. But can I do the knife thing? There you go. Look, there we go. See? They're popping off. Oh my god, oh my god. Alright, start opening this door. Kicking off some heads. Zombies are scared of me, bro. Uh oh. Ain't letting that zombie block me. Step back, boy. Take out that zombie. And that little geek down there. If I don't, you know, miss my shot, I miss my shot again. Okay, it's a little bit embarrassing. You'll look at that first hit. Alright, there you go. That's this door open. That is the power on. So if we get one more kill. We can hit the box. That means we can no longer use this card like 8k. All this M1911, actually. So there he is. Alright, 960 points. Alright, let's go ahead and hit our first hit the box see what we can get oh, i'm really just hoping it's something good not something like dookie like the, like the ptrs bro. bro okay you know what you know what game it's all right you know this is why we do the two box challenge it's for scenarios like this where you get the fucking pants to strike oh my god oh my god the only issue i'm gonna have is actually getting the points oh my god i just killed myself you know what all right one final attempt because that one was really bad i don't know why everything is just going so wrong right now you know what boys i keep it all in all right i keep it real with you guys oh, oh my god i can't even got the pants to strike bro all right boys let's try this again all right this time we're gonna get something good i guarantee you know what is this what we got in the one box challenge video but well, boys history repeats itself what can we say this good is good but like you run so slow with it so all right we're going on to round four because of big moves all right i don't know what my goal is going to be i think i'm going to set world of war at 10 because to be honest we usually do pretty bad in world of war so we'll just try and make up for it in the other games to be fair we have some pretty hard maps on this list i ain't gonna lie also after one more kill we'll be able to get our second hit the mystery box all right there we go all right we've got 950 points go ahead and take a hit at it these zombies are speeding in what we're gonna get we got the m1 grand okay well i I think I know what gun we'll be using. <laughs> Spoiler alert, it ain't gonna be this piece of shit. Well, this is it. It's our two guns. One good gun and one really bad gun. So hopefully things work out for us. We can't obviously buy perks. I'm pretty sure in my one box challenge we played Knack, so like couldn't even buy perks or anything. But this time it's different. But where are these zombies are? Honestly, taking proper long. Like, come on, boys. Like, I actually have such beef with World of War. Like, it's just so slow. I'm gonna try and save up enough points to buy Jug. The only thing I'm worried about with this gun is the reload speed. So I kind of need to buy Speed Color as well, like as soon as I can. Jug will uh, obviously be more important. So. Should Instacart. I guess I'll use this M1 Grand. I'll be our Instacart weapon. Let's go ahead and buy ourselves Jug. Get those extra health. I know in Baruch, like, Jug is, like, super buggy. It's actually really good in Baruch. So, hopefully, that helps us out quite a bit. These zombies are walking again, bro. It's round five. I can speed up. <laughs> actually getting on my nerves. Oh, my God. Where is bro? At? Dude, is, is my game glitched or something? Bro, what are you doing out here? What are you doing out here? Round five, and bro is walking. I actually hate World of War. I really don't like it. Honestly, thank God I came into zombies, like, around, like, in the BO1, start a BO2 time, because if I had to play World of 
world at war or like the start of BO1. Like, bro, I, I would be so, I don't think I'd be a zombie YouTuber, you know? I'm not really a fan of either of those two games. And they're like crucifying me for not liking BO1, but you know, we all have opinions, boys. You know what? We've got a nice little spot here. I mean, my deployable Browning M1919, M1919. I don't know. I'm not American. I just look at the name and go <laughs> to say the funny words. But all right, if we open this door, how much is this? A thousand? Okay, so we need a thousand fifty points. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll be able to buy Speed Cola. And now we're back to our issue that it's the end of the round and the zombie is just like taking his time. I kind of wouldn't be surprised if it's like a plutonium thing because I don't know. I heard some of the spawns in like BO1 plutonium is actually really bad. I don't know how true this is. I read it on the YouTube comments. So, oh, what's good, bro? Oh, and of course, we get double points at the end of the round on zombies when I need you guys the most and actually taking their time. Now, either way, let's just kill that zombie there and then we'll be able to buy speed cola. Now, hopefully, this will help quite a bit. Uh, honestly, I don't know. We'll see. And that is a lot quicker of a reload. So, see, bro, speed cola ain't built like that anymore. In a uh, cold war, like, bro, you barely even notice you have speed cola. All right, boys, so we're on to round eight now. I'm going to buy double tamp. I know it technically just speeds up your bullets instead of just double damage, but honestly, I'm just built different. What can I say? They're beefy right now, bro. Cheeky little insta kill as well. I'm about to go in. M1 Grand's finally going to get shown in this video. See, the two box challenge is basically just baby mode one box challenge. I ain't going to lie. We may can have you then, sir. I feel like I heard somewhere that if you don't open up that door, the zombies won't spawn out this window. If this is true, it's going to be a good little spot to like bunker down, to be honest. All right, boys, we're going on to round nine, all right? We're making it out of these ends, honestly. All right, this is the test of our theory, boys. Oh my god, okay, they're starting to be the rook sprinters. A little bit spooky, but you know what? At least we finally got some first spawns. I'm really worried. I'm keeping an eye behind me. I don't see any coming, though. Yeah, boys, maybe the trick works. See, I do my research for these videos, all right? Grab this nuke. Goes on to round 10, hopefully. Obviously, there's only 24 zombies around. So now we get a nuke, we just want to grab it like as soon as possible. Look at these boys, bro. They're actually so speedy with it. Look, these guys are like regulars. It's when they do like the full like run, bro. Oh, here we go. This is the guy. Oh my god. Oh, it's this guy here, bro. He's still back up, bro. Oh my god. Yo, 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 back up, back up. Yeah, we're good. We're back in position, boys. Speed caller actually came in shooter. If I didn't have a speed caller, it would have been done so, boys. I've always thought about it. Like, who is this little geek, bro? What's he doing? Bro, is he in a hot dog? Like, I don't know what bro is doing in that picture, but we're going to round 11, boys. We're actually making it. Like, I was like, I'm actually like quite surprised. If we can get to like 15, I'll be happy. Because we can make up the rest of those rounds in um in the other games. So we want to go for like 20 in every game. Or like average 20 in every game. But within like 200, you know, quick maths. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. He's sprinting, bro. What's good? Wait, nothing for my brown and MG. <laughs> Should we try the M1 Grand, boys? Yo, guys, I got hot. Go look, guys. The M1 Grand's going hard right now, guys. Don't be jealous. Right, but there we go. And we got an insta kill. So the M1 Grand actually is going to come in useful. Wait anyway, for the last second to grab this insta kill, you know, maximize out the time we get. Let's grab it now, boys. All right, we're going in. Bro, the world of war part of this video is going to be so long. Dude, we got another insta kill. What? It's lucky. All right, are we coming up on round 13 yet? Surely there's not many more zombies. Oh, there we go. All right, round 13. Two more rounds, all right? And I'll be happy, all right? Obviously, we want to try and get to 20 or even further than that, but and 15, I'm, I'm happy with, you know. I walk away with a little grin on my face, you know? It's getting a little bit squeaky. I'm going to have to try and get a cheeky little reload off here. Yeah, we got the reload. We got the reload. Let me go in. Oh my god. 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 Oh my Yo, you can't kill me, little boys. I'm out -y. Oh my god. Oh, dude, are you serious? Oh, bro, I was chatting, bro. That door took so long. <laughs> that was so funny, bro. Oh, I, I don't even know how I took two downs, bro, in solo, but bro, that should have equated to like seven downs, but 13, bro, in uh, World of War. I'm happy with that, right? I'm, I wanted to get 15, but it is what it is. Let's move on to our next game, which is Black Ops 1. That was so funny. All right, then, boys, so onto our next map, we got Ascension. Uh, again, it's the one of those maps that I haven't actually done yet in any of these challenges, so might as well start it now. But yeah, look the boxing ascension isn't too far away plus the overall game mechanics of be one is a lot better than world of war so we shouldn't have too many struggles you know we shouldn't have another repeat of you know world of war so let's go ahead and start making a move boys so we're already on to round two look at that i'm speed running bro let's try and rack up as many points as i can i don't really want to buy a war weapon but i might have to buy the m14 try just go ahead and buy it. Right, i'll just buy it you know give ourselves like a bit of a one war weapon just to make sure we can get to the box and after that we just won't use it pretty much like what we did in world of war so let's just go ahead and start making a move now ascension is one of the easier maps but you know again it's all based on what weapons we get if we get the most dookie little weapons you know we're gonna have a real hard time but we're aiming for 20 plus you know i'm gonna go ahead and I'm, I'm taking i'm taking hold boys i'm taking position you know like what they say in the military i'm a little military boy looks proper weird and you paralyzed like why is the gun so like that why is the gun like that all right so i think we can go ahead and hit the boxes go ahead and open this there we go and on the power just blind myself real quick but then we're gonna go ahead and hit the box for the first time see what we get hopefully it's not something dookie okay the galil already off to a good start i won't lie the only thing with the galil is it doesn't have a whole lot of ammo i guess we can pack a punch now so might not be uh, too bad but where is this last zombie?
zombie. He's actually taking his time, honestly. It's like World War all over again. That's what I mean. I did hear that thing, as I said, in, in you know, while I was playing World of War, that apparently the spawns on Plutonium were like really bad. So yeah, I don't know, but we just move like that. My boys, Galil time. Yeah, the Galil is pretty good. I won't even lie. But we can now hit our second hit of the box to see what we get. Hopefully it's something on par. Maybe the Python. That's actually interesting, you know. I like never use a gun. So <laughs> bro, I still got a cough from uh, when I had COVID, bro. So if I start sounding a bit, you know, goofy. <laughs> That's what it is. Literally, whenever I edit, I gotta cut out all the coughs, bro, because they're like, they're actually awful to hear. Uh, but yeah, you know, the one thing that is good about the two box challenge is that it lets me use guns that I would never usually use. Like, I would never use this Python. And to be honest, I don't think I'd ever use the Galil. Like, obviously, I know the Galil is like one of the best weapons in the game, but still, I always just lean towards Wonder Weapons. So, gonna be interesting how this works. I ain't gonna lie. We up right now. We up. So, I think I already said it. I don't know, actually. I, I said we could pack up a genuine anyway, compared to uh, World of War. So, hopefully, we last a little bit longer. So, I need to make a start on that at some point. All right, so we're coming up onto round six. We're not doing too bad. I do want to buy me some perks to be honest and try and not get clapped by that thing bro like just go underneath it real quick right, but let's go ahead and buy us, uh, ourselves quick revive obviously we can get that now because it actually works and then if i open this door yeah we can come up here and we can also buy jug now to be honest these are the only two perks i'm really gonna need to be honest like PhD is gonna be pointless because you know i'm not really allowed to use it i guess stamina would be nice but it's not like a priority or anything like that all right i think next round will be a monkey round so oh well, next round was not a monkey round all right well i've been st i stand corrected boys dude this galil is actually gonna, like coming is huge. I can already tell it's gonna be like our best weapon, to be honest. Just wanna get through this monkey round, bro. The monkeys ain't coming. All right, surely it's gonna be this round. All right, here we go. Well, let's just make sure they don't touch any of our perks. Because if we don't let them touch any of them, we do get a free perk. So it would be kind of nice. Like, get out of here, monkey. Realistically, they can only come from there or like, I guess they can also drop down, but they can also come down the stairs. So look as I'm looking in this direction, they shouldn't really be able to get to any of my perks. I'm gonna say that, but one that's gonna like, oh, bro, what are you coming from, bro? Where did this monkey come from? He thought he was him, honestly, sneaking around the corners. Sneaky little fucker bro oh right, well, either way there we go we got ourselves a free perk when we get stamina up or i mean there you go you ask and you shall receive boys but perfect so this is pretty much the um the only free perks i really want to be honest so now i think it's probably makes sense to try and make a move on getting pack a punch so let's start opening up some doors gonna be around speed running average model warfare free player be like let's take our first lander out of here i'm moving let's go ahead and fight my way up the stairs here thank god's hardest battles at the moment oh insta kill boys let's take them all out all right our next pad that we need to use it's just over here so let's just go ahead and do that real quick all it is all right, there we go, boys. All right, so this is the second one done. The third one is like, all the way at the top of the map, which is a little bit annoying, but we're on our way up, boys. All right, and so we just head up here. And there we go. Here's our final lunar lander. So after this, we can start up the uh, the rocket launch. Now, yeah, then there'll be a pack punch gone. All right, let's take it out of here. Let's take it out of here. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, just hop out. Just hop out. No way, bro. Oh, dude, they, I didn't think I was... I didn't realize there was that many. That actually caught me off guard, bro. I'm not even going to lie. Well, it was a little bit annoying. Because obviously, I was trying to use all these points to pack a punch, but... I guess, I guess never mind, boys. It actually sucks, bro. So bad. I was trying to hop out of there as well as fast as I could. I thought it was the Easter bunny with how much I was hopping. You don't even realize. Oh, we got the death machine. Okay, that's kind of an L. Go ahead and buy ourselves quick revive back. Oh my god. Be the rushing at me, bro. Oh my god, dude. It's gonna be a I don't even know if I should really buy a jug right now. No, I'm just gonna try and make my way back out. I don't really want to mess around right now. Oh my god. A cheeky little clutch up. You know I'm focusing not, but I don't put any effort into my voice. Oh bro, yo, who is this? Yo, who is this guy, bro? He actually cannot be stopped, bro. I got a little bit too autistic about <laughs> got zombie <laughs> what is that what is that i think that's a carpenter or is it a double point i can't tell it is a carpenter okay yeah let's try and save a zombie this round and i should be able to pack a punch as well i think i'm gonna pack a punch the galil because you know it is the better weapon to be honest even though i do want to pack a punch this python at some point because i think it'll be really cool okay i didn't save a zombie but it is what it is honestly it could be a monkey round you know yeah it's a monkey round okay perfect we're gonna mess up these monkeys these monkeys over there they're dealing with where the monkeys are taking their time honestly there we go he's coming down from here i think he can be sneaky on me a phd flopper all right well a pointless little drop, but it is what it is. Uh, I think I'm gonna wait till the end of the round to pack a punch because I don't really want to risk it. You know, mid round. I'm not that good at the game, boys. Right, you know, this double points into kill combo is actually kind of big. Try and get ourselves the uh, last few points. I think we can pack a bunch more weapons, actually. Yeah, perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and run up here and just activate it real quick. There we go. Go ahead and activate it. Right, well, there goes the rocket. I thought I could blow it with grenades. I couldn't. I'm not that good, boys. So let's go ahead and hop down here. And just in here is the pack a bunch. So yeah, we can get our both our guns pack a bunch. So not doing it too shabby. It only took us about 20 minutes. I think. I don't know. I might be miscounting there, but anyway, so let's make a move out of here. The lamination got the cobra. I'm ready, bro. I'm ready. I'm ready to catch me riding dirty, bro. Gonna catch me riding right dirty. That's such a good video, bro. Honestly, I, once I discovered that video, honestly, my life changed. I'm not even gonna lie. Dude, this lamination, I don't know. It doesn't feel that good, you know. I don't know what it is. It just feels like really unsatisfying to kill. I feel like I like the commando more, you know. But either way, I'm to round 15. I'm not doing too bad. There is an insta kill back there. I'm gonna try and grab that. I don't know what it is. These guns just don't feel very strong. Oh, dude, you see, I picked up a death machine. Well, I'll try and not get any 
kills with it. Right, I think if we kill this one last zombie, that will put us up to... Nah, I'm, I'm actually lying, bro. This last zombie will put us up to around 16. Well, this is pretty much the strategy. I think the main issue now is going to be ammo. I'm just going to grab that nuke. I'm not going to bother wasting my ammo on these guys. I'm worth my bullets, bro. Honestly, get out of here. But yeah, as I said, I think ammo is going to be the main issue, to be honest. I think on three and a half ammo, we're going to really struggle. But we honestly do just move like that, boys. It, it ain't even that deep. Right, there we go, boys. On to round 17. All right, we got another monkey round. I'm my way down back to speed coil and not speed coil. I mean, quick revive and jug, bro. So they're gonna attack uh THD, which is kind of you know, that sucks, but then again, I mean, like, we literally never even use it, so it's not a big deal. Is it a quick revive, bro? Get out of here. Thing is, is the monkeys actually go up in health as well, so like a two shot now to kill monkeys think they're quirky, bro. Step away from the quick revive, bro. All right, they took PhD, but I'm just gonna quickly yoink these guys up because I think these are last two. Yeah, there we go. Our bamboo's on to round 18, then she cooking right now, boys. Obviously, a 20 is the goal. Ideally, I want to get like 20. 25 ish but it's not a big deal if we don't get it by it stamina up as well cheeky little insta going in boy it's like a little I'm, I'm mowing down these zombies bro i'm not gonna lie bro bo one is kind of just like a bit of a boring game sitting here on the verge of a little snooze fest i'm not even gonna lie how about round 19 oh boys let me oh my god how am i squeaking past all these zombies i guess i'm gonna have to drop down here uh oh this ain't looking good oh we just make it out of those ends though honestly it wasn't even, i wasn't even like sweating over it to be honest it's actually too easy and is that round 20 no is this round 20 no is is this one round 20? Right, well, I need to reload, bro. Right, surely this one's round 20. All right, there we go. Bro, bro, it is still one tap into that. It's kind of satisfying, you know? Yeah, I wish we had speed color. Reloading is so slow. Because I know as soon as I buy it, though, I'm just going to lose it on the next monkey round. So I think we do have the, like, the points just to keep rebuying it. So it's not a big uh, issue. But there you go, boys. Round 21. I'm actually making it out of these ends. We are in need of a max up. I ain't going to lie, boys. All right, like, we only got, like, not a whole lot of shots left to my, like, Galil. The, the Python is fully out of ammo. So let's just hope we get a max ammo then, boys. <laughs> Oh, we're gonna really struggle. Oh, and there's the max ammo. Well, I guess we're going on for another like five more rounds, boys. I'll make things a little bit more intense, but you know, game just said, like, nah, bro, you, you're gonna keep going if you like it or not. Oh my god, dude, how am I red screening? I don't know where I'm wrong there, but I'm gonna go buy. Actually, is it a monkey round next round? I don't even know. Yeah, a monkey round has just started, so I'm gonna run straight down to quick revive and jug instead. And I'll come by at the end of the round. They're taking the stamina up. All right, well, it is what it is. Oh my god, these monkeys are a free shot. They don't play around anymore. Bro, these monkeys don't play around. They take like nearly a full shot of the Galil. The monkeys come in, they'll they are, boys. Oh my god, dude. Monkeys are messing me up. Back off, bro. Dude, oh my god. These monkeys actually are not playing around. Oh, back out of here, monkey. Oh, Jesus. Monkey said, I don't even know you. Right, I'm gonna see if I can quickly cop speed color. This might be a big mistake, to be fair, because in our here, it's gonna be actually like really tight. So, new idea. We're gonna call the Lunar Lander. <laughs> Hopefully, we have just enough time to get out. I don't know. We're about to find out. Oh my god, I don't think we're gonna have enough time. Oh my god. Oh, let me out of here, bro. Oh, no, my god. How am I not dead? How am I not dead? How am I not dead? What do you mean? bro <laughs> so much went like down in like two seconds bro i don't know how i didn't die i don't know bro everything is, is a blur bro oh bro are you serious i just died oh my god okay well round 23 it's not too bad and other than that we'll move on to our next game which is black ops 2 right then boys and on to black ops 2 now originally i was going to do mob of the dead but then i saw nuketown on the map and i was like you know what let's use some nuketown zombies right? i barely play this map like ever you know even outside of recording even in recording right? i just never played this map honestly i forgot this map even existed half the time now this map can be really challenging because obviously as you guys can see the perks have to drop from the sky i need to spill my drink over my keyboard bro that was scary but yeah so we don't know when we'll get jug i don't know when i'll get pack a punch i don't know anything right so definitely one of the harder maps plus we've got quick arrive in a really bad location but you know what boys sometimes you've got to put yourself through a challenge right life isn't easy all right content creation isn't easy all right you know for some reason i can't play life on easy mode but yeah all right we move so the box is only over there so we need to open up like two doors which is perfect that means i don't think we'll need to buy the m14 i think we'll be good just to um just go straight for the box to be honest hopefully we don't get something bad obviously we, we could get the smr on the war machine that'd be actually cheeks but surely like the look of getting that or the you know i say the look but like the chances honestly of getting both of those weapons as our two box hits is is next to number but somehow i feel like that's gonna happen so if it does black ops 2 is gonna end real shortly but have a look at this timestamp bro if it's really short then you know you know you know why yeah all right i'm gonna go ahead and open up this door and i'm gonna open up this door as well all right we got 200 points and the box is right there i might need to buy that oh never mind <laughs> Okay, literally, as I'm about to say, I might need to buy that M14. Literally, get a max ammo, boys. It's too easy. A few more points. I'm going to get ourselves our first hit in the box. There we go. So let's go ahead and see what we get. Please be something good. We could get the M27. That'd be kind of high if we did, to be honest. But let's see. And we got the Galil again. Bro, you got me playing, bro. I don't want this dookie little gun again. Let's just get the Python as well as our second hit. That'd be funny. All right, and we can get ourselves our second hit. Let's see what we get. Hopefully, it's something decent. Bro, what is, what 
is the chat? <laughs> bro. That's criminal. Yo, you'd honestly think this is pre-recorded, bro. Look, I'm gonna knife the air. I'm gonna do some proning. You'd think this is pre-recorded, bro. <laughs> that is criminal, bro. What is the chances? I don't even know if it's worth me restarting. I don't know if I want to use these guns again for 20 rounds. Bro, that's actually goofy, bro. <laughs> what is the chances? It's low-key kind of annoying, but like, what are the chances, bro? So over the perk, what is it? It is speed cola. Halfway in the ground. Bro, I actually still cannot believe this, bro. That is criminal. All right, well, I guess these are our two weapons again. I don't, I don't know how long we're going to be able to last with them. I think they might be better in BO2, to be honest, compared to BO1. Every weapon in BO1 just kind of seems to suck. I ain't going to lie. Also, I have no idea when I'm going to get Jug or anything like that. So I'm just going to buy Speed Cola now because I think the next drop honestly could be on like round 10. So there you go. At least we're a little bit more buffed up. We just got to be careful not to get uh, an unlucky double swipe, to be honest. But right, going on to round six, cheeky little insta kill in here. We don't really need an insta kill. Like, we've kind of, you know, doing well in terms of like what weapons we got. I mean, yeah, I just kind of can't believe it, bro. So much for some like different weapons in this uh, video. What did I say in this video at the start? Like, I get to use some weapons I never usually use. Well, here you go. All right, on to round seven, boys. I just want to see when we're going to get a next drop because, yeah, we could do it with, like pack punch or jug, to be honest. Like, even double tap. Double tap's going to be pretty good now. I think this is meant to tell us how many kills we need until the next drop. I'm not too sure, though, but I'll say 94. That's a lot of kills. All right, we're on to round eight. Slowly making our way there, boys. I think this is the better area to train in. It's a bit more bigger, so I'm going to sit here from now on. Oh, the mountain. Yeah, what's good, old geek? Okay, another little insta kill. Let's grab that. Oh, there we go. All right, we're getting a perk, but I didn't think we had 94 more kills or whatever it was. So, like, I don't know what the thing in the middle is for, to be honest. All right, but let's go see what we got. Hopefully, it's either jug, double tap, or pack a punch. I think they're actually, like, the only few things we have left to get, so that has to be one of them. And we got double tap. Okay, I mean, out of all of them, this is probably the one I wanted the least. I kind of want jug as soon as possible, to be honest. But you know what? Double tap will still help. Basically, like, pack a punch, to be honest. So, yeah, uh, ammo is becoming a bit of a problem now, I just realized. So, we need to uh, keep on track of that. Yeah, double tap is definitely, like, helping a lot. thing is, is we won't get another perk drop until, like, we're, like, around 14 or 15. Oh, dude, we got max ammo. That's perfect. All right, boys, on to the double digits now. Around 10. But I'm really hoping we get another drop soon. Like, I know it's not going to happen, but, dude, I, I just... I, I feel more comfortable with jug, bro. I ain't going to lie. Saying a four more kill. I don't know what that even means. To find out, I guess. It's changing that. Weird. I don't know what that is for. Oh, on to round 11. Also, I think that's to do with the um, free drop that's behind that door. So every like 100 kills, the drop changes or you get a new one. It's one of the two. That point, there's a weird feature, but you know. I feel like with my look, I'm going to get Jug on round 20. I can already kind of feel it. I'm going to grab that new guy ain't playing around wasting any of my ammo. All right, we're getting another drop and we're going on to round 12. So I think it's coming right towards me as well. So I don't even have to move. All right, is it going to be Pack a Punch or is it going to be Jug? I think it's Pack a Punch. Okay, you know what? I'll take it, boys. I'm going to Pack a Punch with my guns. Well, actually, we'll have Jug on round like 15, 16, maybe 17. Because obviously we got Quick Revive right at the start. So <laughs> yeah, we're back with the Lamination and the Cobra. Yeah, we're really moving up in the world right now. And I saw Insta Kill into round 13. All right, we're not doing too bad. Well, I know. I just really want to play the BO2 campaign again. I think I brought it up in a video about how I just have this really weird urge to play it. I still haven't even played it, but I really want to just play it again. I don't know why. It's such a good campaign, man. Oh, what? How did I die? I like actually got insta kill. That was weird. Not very good though. I don't really want to die this early, so I need to like kind of clutch up, clutch up for the boys real quick. You know what it is. Try and buy quick revive back as fast as possible. This is the one that's most risky, to be honest. But oh, I've got another insta kill. Okay, well that makes our life a bit easier. Go ahead and buy speed color, and we'll also buy double time. I think if we kill that zombie, that's gonna be round 14. So actually making it out of these ends. You know what? A part of me is starting to wish I actually did get the war machine just to make something interesting about this, bro. This is the same two guns. You're making me tear up a bit. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, bro, are you serious? I died again. I have an L. I'm not even gonna lie, dude. I'm getting just so many unlucky two hits or double hits, bro. It's kind of making me a bit upset. I ain't even gonna lie, but either way, we'll go ahead and pick up our final quick revive. Oh my god, the zombie trying to catch me slipping, bro, in a bit. Yeah, we're going on to round 16. Hopefully, we'll get our final perk soon. If we don't, I'm, I'm gonna honestly cry. Oh, and there it is. Speak of the devil, bro. Where is Jug gonna land? Because this is Jug, like, guaranteed. Of course, I don't have any points for Jug now. A little bit of an L, and it's gonna appear up there. Means I've got to buy another door, but you know, boys, we honestly just move like that. They ain't even that big of a problem. Let's go ahead and buy Jug, hop out this window. Not bad boy like that. And uh, I feel a bit more settled now. I'm more confident in getting to round 20. Oh, it's going on to round 17. We're making it, bro. What round is it where that ice turns to blue? Is it round 25? I think it's round 25. I think it's round 20. We're just, we're just chilling, bro. You know, like, the double tap 2.0, the lamination and the cobra, you know, it ain't, it ain't too bad, you know? Oh, what is it? <laughs> what is this, bro? We've got some drops here. It's actually drop central, bro. What is going on? Yo, as many of these little geeks as I can. I'll just grab this nuke now. Hopefully, I'll end the round. There you go. Round 19. Another little cheeky insecure. We're going in. Let's grab this nuke, and I think that'll be round 20. And we're actually going in, boys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ooh, let me out of here, bro. You haven't got a nuke, bro. Oh my god. And it's sick, bro. It's honestly just too easy. But what are we up to so far? We got 13 in World of War. We got 23 in BO1. It's up to 36. So I think we need like 24. You know, 
put us back on track for like 20 like rounds a game on average so it should hopefully we'll get the the 200 total rounds that's all i'm hoping for every time i feel like i'm gonna run out of ammo there's always just a max ammo so i mean you know we're, we're good for another couple of rounds you know and there it is but it's round 22 making our way downtown you know oh my god hold up hold up oh my god Ooh, okay not not good boys 22 might be our limit oh my god is this door gonna be able to bike fast enough quickly bro all of our perks are on the other side of the map got our leap through window but get out of our way through windows you know all right let's make our way up here i think they're probably gonna jump up that's fine by jug big while we're only zombies all right i'm feeling a little bit better now come down here buy myself some double tab myself some speed color right there we go but that means that one more down and it's over bro we're done so all right is that round 23 that is round 23 boys so we just need to do one more round for us to kind of like break even on everything so i'm feeling good boys i'm feeling good oh my god dude these guns are becoming real weak dude nice we got a little insta kill there that should help us all right i think we're at the end of round 23 where's the zombies at? they're hiding from me they're scared all right there we go boys we're on to round 24 We've officially broke even. I'm pretty sure, unless my mouse is like full on autistic. But yeah, I mean, there's no point just stopping. I guess we'll keep going. Maybe rounds we can rack up because I think the next game will be a bit of a hassle, bro. A bit of a faff. So even if we could build like, I don't know, two or three more rounds, this says we're going to do it in the next game. So I mean, bro, actually, this could honestly just be it, bro. I ain't even going to lie. I'm actual squeaky bum time right now. But back off, bro. Back off. Yo, grabbing this new. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Know your place. Is this here? Is this round 25? But there we go. Round 25. Weird noise coming from this TV, bro. Rick's talking. What are you getting up to? Right, but I think that means that the zombies will have blue eyes now yeah look there they are boys the weirdos do i dare even say i'm running quite low on ammo on the cobra do i dare even say it you know what it's not looking good for our ammo situation i ain't gonna lie this even is to give us a max ammo very soon and i mean like literally the next like two zombies and we are completely out of ammo i guess we can try and kill them with grenades <laughs> i did i think there's the last three zombies as well these cheeky little galva knuckles i'll never even know what hit them bro i want to at least get round 26 right, i need that one extra uh, round under my belt yeah little boy there he is round 26 boys actually too easy now I'm, I'm gonna die like <laughs> I have no ammo bro I could go hit the box again and try and get the weapon back but I mean it kind of defeats the point of a two box oh my god actually wait a minute boys imagine the uproar imagine a world imagine it oh dude that would have actually been so clutch oh, oh I'm red screening oh I'm stuck in the garage bro okay well round 26 not too bad I don't know how we managed to get the same guns as BO1 uh, that, that's actually mad to me but either way we'll jump onto our next game which is advanced warfare right then boys so on to advanced warfare we've got an outbreak and because honestly I just want to give myself a little bit of a break right all the advanced warfare maps are kind of dookie and this one isn't isn't as dookie all right so yeah, let me check out this one the box is also really close by so kind of another reason why i want to do this map uh, over any of the others but yeah, like usual we're aiming for round 20 uh, and yeah i mean advanced warfare is going to be a little bit more difficult because obviously we need to make sure we don't uh, fall behind on upgrading any of our guns kind of a real big part of uh of this game is just making sure that you you know you're constantly upgrading your guns you know and uh, and yeah it can get kind of difficult so hopefully we get something good if we get two really dookie guns i actually might cry let's right, start opening some doors and here is the box so i think we'll hit it once shit now nah, i might as well get both hits out of the way before i go get the exosuit all right so there's our first hit of the box we can go get let's go ahead and hit that all right and we've gotten the bro literally right basically the python this is ridiculous bro how many times am i gonna get basically the python bro oh my god i'm gonna get like the battle 27 after this all right well this gun is cheeks bro no for a fact i'm gonna be using this <laughs> this gun is so bad i think i got this in my one box challenge actually and it actually nearly broke me it was that bad well, i mean either way there's our next hit of the box i swear to god watch this get something that's equivalent to the galil i'm gonna be actually raging right, and we got the imr i think it's called yeah that's just a three round burst assault rifle not quite the galil but you know oh, it's a four round uh, assault rifle okay well oh my god did i just trade out my bro i just traded out my other gun i'm actually a little silly billy bro well i guess we're kind of down to one gun instead <laughs> if I, I probably would never use a r1 or rw1 or whatever it's called so i mean i suppose it is what it is but there's our exosuit anyway so now i can hop around i don't really know what the strategy is i just need to get set up and get my perks and stuff like that that's kind of my like main priorities right now right, if i make my way down here uh jug is just in here so let me go ahead and turn on the power all right and there's jug so let's just go ahead and save up some points we making it bro I'm not really a massive fan of advanced warfare to be honest so i kind of just want to be off this game like as soon as possible oh my god dude the emp zombies are already inbound yeah lost little bro let's go ahead and buy exo hell all right we're into the main hubs this is, i think this is gonna be our main training area all right i'm gonna start upgrading my gun i think actually as i said like i don't want to fall behind on like not upgrading my weapon so yeah, let's go ahead and upgrade our weapon to the i am a mark two that will literally be no difference by the way like you won't feel a difference in these upgrades it's so annoying like in track games when you upgrade a weapon you feel the regression right in this game like you just don't like you don't even notice it basically just feel like you have a basic ass weapon the entire game oh okay here we go so we got the infected zombies ideally i want to try and not get infected but it's honestly not as easy as it looks actually then again bro this honestly might be the strat bro what's a little strategy oh what where did you come from i wonder if i'll be able to end the round before uh you know i can die there we go bro actually wasn't that bad oh with that 
zombie came from that infected bee, but you know, we move. And we'll go ahead and upgrade our weapon again. So the Mark III now. Uh, massive double points, actually, because again, yeah, just trying to upgrade my weapon as much as I can. I need to get speed color as well. It would be nice if we had that. I think we'll go ahead and upgrade this. We can upgrade it twice, you know. We're up to Mark V. Well, honestly, we're cruising for it. We're already at 10 rounds. I didn't even realize. I'm actually flying for advanced warfare. I'm speed running, boys. Only been 11 minutes. A little hyper damage for us. Gonna come in pretty nice. And I guess we'll upgrade it again. All right, round 12, boys. Again, I think the main thing that I think is going to end our run here will probably be ammo. I don't think there's a way to easily get back ammo unless you just upgrade your weapon. So that's what I need to start doing is just using up all the ammo in the upgrade before I go to upgrade it. So why I think having um speed cola will like be actually massive to be honest. So oh my god. That's true we don't have quick revive. Wait, that's what I need more than speed cola. Holy. I actually need to upgrade my weapon again. See, I'm trying to save up points, but I just can't. But either way, that we're going on to round 13. Oh, I think there's another infected round. Yeah. That's good. It means we get uh, max ammo at the end of this round. So whatever points we get, we can kind of just save up. Infected round is going pretty well so far. I haven't been infected. We've actually racked up a decent few, uh, few points. So I think we'll be able to get speed cola at, at the end of uh, speed, bro, at the end of this round. Oh, but of course we get infected like pretty much right at the end. Like sure that there can't be any like that many more zombies. There we go. Let's go ahead and buy exo reload back into our little training spot. Oh my god, oh my god. Dude, the exo zombies are the EMP zombies, bro. They're actually spooking me, but dude, oh my god, dude, the EMP zombies are actually the worst, bro. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and buy exo soldier. That should let me run while um I shoot and stuff like that so yeah we're on to round 15 now is there only like one dog round it's like the entire game because i've not seen another one it's been like 10 rounds oh my god oh my god dude i got cornered that's not even right is that gonna be our exo soldier no we kept exo soldier okay fair enough oh my god i'm gonna die again bro, bro what am i meant to do bro i'm getting emps on me these guys are running around corners oh my god that sets us back quite a bit oh that sucks all right well either way let's just move on to our next game uh which is black ops 3 right then boys so we're on to our black ops 3 right now the map i picked is Shadows of Evil. Why? Honestly, there's no real reason why I picked Shadows of Evil. I just did. So yeah, before I do any of the ritual stuff, I want to go ahead and get my two box weapons. Because honestly, I could open it up before like round four, but I'll make it a little bit more of a challenge, you know. Black Ops 3, pretty much any gun in Black Ops 3 is good, so I'm not really sweating too hard on that. Where is it? Is it down here? I guess I'll just go ahead and zap that. And we might as well open up the rest of the map where we can. Obviously, just some rules for Black Ops 3. No like alternate ammo types or anything like that. That would be way too easy. So literally just, just the pack punch weapon itself. Uh, no sword or anything like that because obviously on shadows so yeah i mean pretty much just play the game in like the same way i'd play any of the other games because if i did use like like all ammo types like dead wire bro i could literally go on forever oh yeah and i'm not gonna use any of my oh my game's frozen let's go i'm not gonna use any of my gobble gums or anything like that but let's go ahead and see what our first gun is hopefully it's something good we got the weevil uh not the best weapon in the world honestly it, it could be better but you know maybe the weevil is you know underrated maybe there's a there's a hidden thing to it all right second hit of the box to see what we get I'm hoping for something semi-decent we got the mana what dude we got this is now one hit chance, bro. I swear we just keep getting the same weapons. That should kind of make me grumpy, but you know, I'm going to go do some of the beast mode stuff now. Also turn on quick revive since we need that. And I think that's everything. So let's go ahead and buy quick revive. And then we'll go do uh, the first ritual because, you know, like make a start on those. So there we go. All right, there we go. There's the first ritual done. And we can also go do the second one since we've got all the stuff for the uh, burlesque open. Then with that Margo, we should get enough points actually to open up uh, another uh, ritual room. So actually too easy, boys. All right, let's start the second ritual. Actually too easy, bro. Wasn't even so wetting, to be honest. I can't believe we've had, like, just some of these dead weapons. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, it's either stuff we've used before, or, you know, it's actually just mainly stuff we used before. Like, I think so far, everything but BO2, I've at least had the same weapons I did in my one box challenge. <laughs> the Browning and World of War. I mean, BO1, BO2 in this game has just been the same. The RW1, Irons, or whatever it was called, in Advanced Warfare in my one hit challenge. The Man of War in my one box challenge. It's ridiculous, bro. Yeah, I've just put some different weapons. That's so much for one man to ask. I do this little cheeky little tactic right here. Look at that. I didn't even see that coming. Right, and that is the part I got on as well. So we're making it out of these ends, boys. We're making it, right? It's taking time. We're getting through it. And once I do be able to pack lunch, it's going to be very epic. Pick up the badge. All right, that's the third ritual done. Wait, how do I get up here? Oh, dude, I've done this proper dodgy no, bro. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to make it. I'm going to try my little hardest, though. Oh, that's actually upsetting. Either way, let's just pick up the belt. Go ahead and we'll open up this properly now. No more messing about. Oh, my God, dude. Dude, oh, my God. Out of the four rituals, this is definitely the hardest. Maybe I should have just done it all on a really low round. Wait, wait, bro. Stop the ritual, are you for real? This is funny or something. Like, no, nah, start that back up. Right, there we go. Honestly, bro, these guns are kind of cheeks, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. But either way, we've got ourselves a Margua popping up. Let's try and catch the smoke, so we'll go ahead and take him out real quick. Right, there you go. Margua. Oh, what? I actually cannot believe that. How'd I die around seven? What happened? What went wrong? I'm actually so upset, bro. Oh, uh, I guess we move on to the next game. All right, then, boys. So, on to Infinite Warfare. The map we've got is Zombies in Spaceland. Uh, I can't remember if we've actually done a video on. Zombies in Spaceland, like 
for a challenge. So, you know, here we are having a go at it. This map will be uh, pretty fun you know, to actually play through. So, but what, what is this? We can get a guided tour, but I don't want a guided tour. It's a little different, bro. I don't need that. So, yeah, I don't know how soon we'll be able to get uh, to the box because it's all the way over there. Actually, miles away, bro. We were so far away from the box, bro. Actually, miles away. Now, let's open up this door. And let's make our way all the way over here. And I think we have one more door we need to open, which is this one. And then we can finally get to the box. See, the thing is, right, is having no ammo is kind of an L. I'm not even going to lie. It's all right, all right. I've got a plan. You wouldn't even expect it. Let's just see if this guy drops ammo, actually. Oh, well, they dropped ammo. Okay, we're good. Only 12 bullets. Oh, yo, I'm actually loaded up. Don't mess with me, bro. Let me pull out my, my 12 bullet candles. All right, let's open up this. And the box is there. Bro, this is actually the furthest box away I've, I've ever seen, bro. Why do you have to be all the way over here? But all right, we just need to get 950 points. I just need this guy to hop down, bro. How many times I got to melee you? How many times I got to teach you this lesson, old man? Yeah, 10 points away now. Basically there. And there we go. So what is our first weapon going to be, boys? And we got the... Oh, my God. You actually cannot make it up, bro. The intervention, pretty much. It's actually kind of annoying. Like, I knew at some point we were going to get a sniper, at least. <laughs> I didn't think it was going to be this soon, bro. You know what? It's fine. We just move like that. I'm not even sorting out. Why with that next gun? It's going to be something decent, though, because when we get the clown round, bro, I don't think the sniper is going to cut it. All right, so what are we going to get? We're going to get the... the bro. Oh, it's, it's over. <laughs> it's over, bro. Bro, I'm going to have to lower it down, bro. That's criminal. I'm going to have to lower the amount of total rounds down, bro. Like, this is not going to happen. This is what I get for shit talking, getting the galil twice, bro. I, should, I shouldn't have complained. All right, here's the clown round. God, I only bought a quick reviver or anything. Oh my god, why did I just shoot myself? Why did I do that? Bro, my intrusive thoughts kicked in, bro. All right, we're kind of we're kind of doing all right. All right, we managed to get past the clown round at least. All right, I'm buying me some tough enough, bro. I need to go back and get quick revive though, like desperately. Yeah, I'll be honest, I ain't lasting very long without quick revive. Not with these shitty weapons. Like, bro, running out of ammo is a whole different issue now. All right, get ourselves some quick revive or upper atoms. The only other thing I can think of that would be really helpful is to get bang bangs, which is basically like double tap if you guys don't know. That's all the way on that side of the map. All right, it's fine. We'll make our way over there, but I need this. Where's the zombie at, bro? Where's hiding from me? I don't know what I'm going to do when the big brute comes in. I actually think that's the end, bro. I was picking off zombies, honestly. Oh my god, my game's lagging, though. Right, Bang Bangs is all the way over there. I'm pretty sure it's a load of points as well. All right, we'll also start activating all the teleporters on the map so we can get pack a punch. Uh, I'd, honestly, I'd, that's if we even save up for it. Oh, it's only just that door there. We can just buy Bang Bangs. Okay, we're making it out of these ends. Oh my god, dude, I don't want to die, though. The yeah, ammo is now showing to be a slight issue, even though I just said a minute ago that it wasn't going to be much of an issue, but you know, ignore me. But I need to get in here, but dude, I just got the money, bro. What money am I getting with a sniper? Thing is, right, is this game like it never drops a max ammo. This game's never even heard of that. <laughs> Once I'm out of ammo, bro, it's over. Oh, insta kill. Oh my god, I'm literally red screen. How has this happened? Right, this pilot's actually gonna be massive insta kill. Oh, ammo kill, we need that. Just that little bit of ammo for the savers. All right, let's turn on the power here, and here's the portal to get back to spawn. So, oh, bro, we are in for a treat when this guy spawns, bro. 11 bullets and four rocket launcher shots. Truly, I'm in, bro. Oh, here's the brute. It was good, my guy. Oh, he's taking off his head already. Oh my god, oh my god. How'd I die, bro? Oh my god. This game hates me, bro. I don't think I've got the money to get back my lost and forge, uh, lost and found. Oh no, it's free. Okay, that's not as bad. Oh, he's taking off the helmet, bro. I'm going in my two shots. He's, he's not even ready for me. And oh, oh, we're actually fully dead. Okay, well, oh my god, dude. Infinite Warfare actually slapped me around silly, bro. Treat me like his little play doll. That was gross. All right, well, I guess that's Infinite Warfare. We'll move on to our next game, which is World War II. Right then, boys. So, on to World War II zombies. Now, the thing is with this map that I picked is I've actually, like, I don't think I've ever played it. <laughs> so, I have no idea where I'm going. So, we're already off to a great start. So, how would you even, like, work on getting out of this room? <laughs> Bro, where do I go? And, like, where would even the box be? Oh, okay, we're going here. No, no, mind. It's just a <laughs> very suspicious looking cave. You know, boys, we just make it out of these ends. I'll, I'll figure out where I need to go. Don't even worry about it. I, I really do feel like it's there, though. Oh, wait, you need to stand on this? Oh, oh, okay, you have to get kills on this thing. But maybe I picked the wrong map for this. Oh, there we go. Oh, we're in, boys. What the fuck is that thing? I don't know what that was. I'm not interested to find out. What I am interested to find out is where the box is. That's all that matters to me. All right, let's keep making our way down. I wish I was like an indicator of where the box was. Make my life so much easier. I guess we'll check down here. <laughs> where is the box? This is a location for it, but it's not the box. You know, I'm starting to think maybe I should have played a different map. Oh, what if I just activated? I guess we keep moving down here. Bro, what is this? Bro, that was the most pointless little thing I've just done. I'm not buying a wall weapon, all right? No matter how how far this box is? I'm sticking to just this M1911. If I thought I'd be playing this map for the first time. Alright, let's keep moving, boys. Surely the box can't be any further down, bro. Through this door? Bro, where is it? Like, where the fuck is the box? Oh my god, there's so many more doors I gotta open, bro. And it's one of these little rat boy rounds. Yeah, I'm not messing with you. Go away. I'm not interested. Alright, boys, what's behind door number one? Do-do-do-do. Jeopardy music, bro. Like, bro, I- Oh, dude, we 
found it. Oh my god, finally, bro. All the way down here, bro. Bro, it's hiding from me. It's supposed to be the best weapon I've ever got in my entire life, bro. The goat too? Oh, this can better be good. All right, well, let's hit our second hit at the box. See what we get. We got the jack in the box. All right, well, it was fun while that lasted, boys. Do people count the jack in the box? I'm going to count the jack in the box. I think people don't count it on one box challenge, but I ain't doing the one box challenge. I'm a little bad boy like that. Never even heard of that challenge. All right, well, I don't know what to do next now. I guess we just keep exploring the map. This map looks so complicated. Like, I would not be able to understand this. Like, what is this? All right, well, on to round seven. We are making it out of these ends very slowly. I got, what is going on? What is going on? Why are they getting, like, sucked up? Filled the first pool. What does that even mean? Or whatever that means. I'm out, Ebro. Uh, the only thing is, I'm actually out of ammo. How has this happened? <laughs> how, how am I out of ammo? I mean, I guess I could just pop this and then scavenge some ammo. It's the only thing I can do. I swear, man. non track games, they're so stingy with their max ammo. All right, we managed to get 120 bullets, but we're backwards. And that is round seven complete. So we're on to round eight. Bro, I'm out here fighting for my life in the second half of this video. Honestly, bro, the first half we were cooking, bro. The second half, I'm actually, I'm struggling. Oh my God, this is a tight little spot for me. What is this? Faster reload speed. I guess we're buying this. Even though I haven't got any ammo to reload with again. All right, let's go back in, boys. We're going to have to scavenge some more ammo. Come on, give me some ammo. Bro. Bonus jolts, bro. Do you really think I need money right now? Lethal equipment. Bro, more jolts. I don't need jolts. I need ammo, bro. Bro. Oh, there's a little bomber zombie. Holy shit. All right, we're on to wave it. We are actually struggling, bro. I'm fighting for my life. All right, we're going to have to go back scavenging for some ammo because I'm just fully out. Actually, what am I doing? I've got, um, that's why I use my jack in the box. Q. There you go. I've got these little bad boys and I can use them because, you know, they're actually like one of my weapons. See, I'm too smart, boys. I'm not going to lie. I'm using my shovel more than I'm using my gun. Come back to the melee only challenge. I swear down. All right, well, that is the end of round nine. Went on to round 10. Well, at least we'll get a max ammo after these guys. I just realized it. I'm making out of these ends. Dude, I don't know how you get pack a bunch. It's actually a mystery to me. That's a big fool, you know. All right, I filled the, the second blood pool. I don't really know what that means, but I did it. I'd assume this is something to do with like pack a bunch. So if I find that last one, I actually might be able to do something in the map. I feel like it has to be this, but it's just not. Yeah, that's no, not like changed or anything after I did the second one. I don't know. Right, that's the end of round 11. So we're going on to round 12 now. To be honest, I don't really know how much longer I'm going to be able to last. Like, bro, I'm cutting up. I'm pulling up on my limits now. We're going in here. I'm out. What, 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 what's going on? What, what, what's good, pack a punch what happened bro can i use it what's going on what bro, what is going on bro <laughs> what just happened maybe it's telling me i have to do that last blood pool before i can use it i don't know bro that was confusing is this not it no i don't think it is we've done this one uh, i mean i'm not really too sure where the last one is uh oh uh oh this isn't good this isn't good I'm back off bro Dude, world war 2 is actually the most confusing game bro i swear to god uh, also i'm back to being out of ammo so that's nice didn't need the ammo anyways to be honest you know i'm just a little bad boy like that but what happens if i take this again i'm actually so confused on what what happened? Bro, what are these things? Bro, who are you, bro? Back off, bro. You look like a soul eater thing from Harry Potter, bro. What? I use my revive, apparently. Okay. So, apparently, for me to get Pack-A-Punch, I need to do that uh, thing with a tube three times, and I guess three different locations, which is fine if I knew where the other tubes actually were. Poured the hidden depths with great speed. What can I say? I'm a little speed runner, but yeah, I kind of need to get Pack-A-Punch, or else I'm not going to be able to really go anywhere, because I'm out of ammo completely. Oh my god, I think I'm dead here. No, I ain't getting out, bro. Increased melee damage. I'm going to need that bro. bro i don't know what i'm to do right, i'm headed back in boys technically i've taken it twice it does say you need to take it three times but look there you go look it's slowly coming back out so yeah but i think you need to do it in three different locations so okay, now we just gotta take it from here oh it says transport is unavailable okay oh can it become available please i ain't really got time to be messing around bro what is going on who even are these guys bro actually trying to catch the smoke like no one even knows who you are bro okay throw one of these little bad boys down all right we somehow beat wave 13 honestly i don't even know what this video is anymore this section is on breeder video but right, if we take this i think we'll now be able to get the pack a bunch it is actually just too easy like oh where'd i go what, what, why, why didn't i get taken to the tele pack a bunch room what happened i'm going again bro you're in a bit alligator that's not even the same bro see you later alligator i'm gone thanks to the pack a punch room what why can't i go back there bro come back here why are you running bro are you scared yeah that's right get lost game oh my you know what i don't even care bro this game is so shit bro it's actually unreal oh my god all right moving on to the next game i don't want to ever touch this game again bro this game is a pile of shit right boy so on to Black Ops 4, we have an Ancient Evil. I don't know why I picked Ancient Evil. Honestly, I just don't really play this map enough. Pretty much the same reason I pick any of the other maps. Now, hopefully, this one will go better than World War 2 Zombies because uh, that was actually, uh, that left me sad, all right? I had to go sleep after that, all right? I had to take another nap. It's a whole new day. So yeah, hopefully the two-box challenge goes better on this game. I don't even know where the box is, to be honest. You know, that's a, that's a good start. Usually, bro, okay, there it is. That's what I was about to start crying about the like, baby mode. It's a raging. All right, let's get out of here. So the box is just down here. So we can actually get our first hit the box now. Let's go ahead and hit this little bad boy see what we get and we got the double cross with my little like anime skin on it can't tell if this gun is good i think i had it during like my rush video i think it was all right yeah here we are 
Another thousand points. We're gonna go ahead and hit the box again and see what we get. Imagine it's the Helion Salva, bro. Oh, okay, it's the AN94. So honestly, sometimes I forget they even added this into this game, you know. It's just like a weird little addition, but okay, now I've actually got to like try and get set up. I completely forgot about the whole settle part of this. These guns are, are gonna drop off pretty soon, I think. All right, so we're on to round five. Let me go ahead and open this door. And then here is the Sentinel artifact. So we're gonna go ahead and start that. Who's this little geek, bro? Honestly, who do you think you are? What a cheeky little thing in. Look at these guns, bro. They think they're cool. Just because they can revise themselves from the dead. All right, bro, it's getting a little bit hectic. Look at all these zombies coming out. Look at all these zombies, bro. Look how close they're getting to me. This is insane, boys. It's <laughs> straight fires, bro. Right, where's Pegasus, anyways? You know, teaching these little bad boys a lesson. All right, now we gotta go get the Pegasus saddle. I have no idea where that is. Like, it, honestly, like, I can either find it super easy or I could just never find it. It's it, Which one's gonna happen, boys? Oh, it's here. Okay, well, there you go. We found it pretty easily. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. This little geek is here with me. Yo, you gotta go, bro. Yo, let me out of here. Yo, uh, he's gotta go, bro. He's gonna die. He's shielding up, bro. He thinks he's quirky. Oh, okay. He's still alive, bro. Oh, we got him? Wait, yo, he's dead. Yo, get out of here. Look at him sweating about it. Right, I think all we gotta do is just head down here and then I guess it should just be here. I don't I don't know what actually spawns them in. Oh, here he is. It's good little boy. Good little bro. Right, I'm gonna buy uh, stamina up as well. Right, I'm making my way out of here, bro. I'm just gonna skip this cutscene, you know? I ain't, I ain't even gonna watch Pegasus take us out. I'm trying to skip it, bro. Be on board. Let me skip, bro. All right, I guess I'm not allowed to skip. Okay, there we go. Yo, let me get out of here, boys. So, obviously, the way that you uh, have to open up this cage is, is by hitting it with uh, the, the specialist. So, that's the only time I'm gonna use the specialist in this entire, like, part of the video. Because I think it's a little bit OP, all right? You know, two box challenge, you know, you could get the most dooky little weapons and then you get, like, an entire wonder weapon just by pressing Q. So, all right, here's the last one. So, if I just go ahead and beat that up, you'll get this little bird out of here. All right, so they're gonna start blowing this little thing up. So, I gotta just, you know, try and not die. Oh my god, there's a big guy. Bro, how is this fair, bro? Yo, back off, bro. I don't know you. Stranger danger. Yo, I'm gonna catch him. I'm gonna flank him up, boys. Oh, he's not even ready. Oh, we got him. Yeah, clowns, baby, bro. Sit down. Right, well, here's Panker Punch. So, we can start trying to save up for that. All right, I need, I wanna buy Quick Revive because Quick Revive is actually, like, really good in this game. So, I'm gonna try and save up the points for that. I do wanna get Panker Punch, but the thing with Panker Punch in this game is it's so expensive, bro. Obviously, it's 5,000 for the base one. Then you've got a pack a bunch of over four times using the, uh, the double upgrade, which is like 2,500. So, you know, doing some quick math, boys. It's 1,500 points. Oh, geez, not 1,500. 15,000 points if you want a pack a bunch. You know, I got quick maths. Well, like, pack a bunch are going all the way to like the max it can be. I've got to do that twice, bro. Ain't got me messed up, bro. All right, I guess we get saving up, boys. All right, I guess I'm going to pack a bunch of the AN94. I think it's better than the double cross, to be honest. It's more like powerful. So, we've got the Nightmare Awakened 49. I was going to say, should it not be the Awakened Nightmare 94? But then I realized that the, they've all got it kind of backwards. You know, I don't know what ever Treyarch was thinking when they made, you know, the name for this gun, but you know, we just let we just let them be, all right. I'm sure uh, it was probably like some special, you know, make a wish kid. All right, so we're on to round nine. We're actually cooking, boys. I think I'm just gonna pack a bunch of the guns once just for now. And then I'm gonna go get the rest of my perks and then I'll come back. And that's the strategy. Because to be fair, I don't really play Ancient Evil outside of just like doing the Easter eggs. So I don't even know like where's a good spot to train or anything. Right, let's grab this nuke, and then that should give us enough points to pack and try gun. There we go. So we also now have a Fang the Doom. Uh, some real crazy stuff, boys. You know, like, the good names in this set, they're just, they hit different, you know. This gun has a lot of ammo, though. Holy shit. Right, I'm done spending my time in here, right? I'm getting out of here, right? This place is too, you know, it's too small for me. A big fellow like me, you know, an absolute beefcake, right? I need a big area to sit in. Thing is, though, is I don't really need PhD Slider, which is, I probably should have refought my perks, you know. But although I don't need, like, the effects of PhD Slider, I do want the speed color bonus that you get with it. So I'm going to save up for that. All right, let's go ahead and buy PhD Slider. All right, I think the last perk we need is just down here. There you go. Let's go ahead and cop that. Now we should have bonus of a uh, speed cola. All right, onto round 12. We're kind of cooking right now. And now I guess we just save up enough points to upgrade our weapons. So we could do with some lucky double points. I ain't gonna lie, but I mean, it is what it is. We're kind of just mowing through these zombies right now, honestly. I actually don't know who I am. All right, I'm gonna head my way back down to where Pegasus was, I think. I need to buy this. And Pegasus is telling me that thing here. They can't have anyone say uh, the Dorman hand. Let me just make my way down here to where the Pekka Poonch is. And I guess I'll do my AN94 first because I think this is just gonna be the better weapon. The double cross isn't bad though. Like, it's like it's a bad weapon. It's just, you know, ain't just, it just ain't the AN94 to be honest. So we upgraded it twice. I'm gonna upgrade it a third time real quick. Right, and look at that. We're only 500 points away from being able to max out this AN94. This map is actually so underrated. I ain't gonna lie. Oh my god, there's a Blight Father. Oh my god, dude. I'm actually one tap, bro. Because I was not ready to catch the smoke from that Blight Father, but he should be dead soon. You're like, I'm clapping him right now. Okay. Oh my god, dude. Okay, that is actually kind of unfortunate. Oh, am I gonna lose three of my perks? Game, please revive me, bro. I don't want to lose quick revive, please. Oh, actual clownish behavior from uh, this game, but you know, it's whatever. All right, I'm gonna buy a maxed out AN94. That should be maxed out now. So yeah, the price has gone down. So, although I did keep uh, two of my perks, I just lost Zeus and Odin. You know what? I'll let it slide. Pretty sure Odin was back in the um, underground area, and I don't remember where Zeus is. But I was out the other day, you know, at my university, and I bought me an Aero chocolate bar. Now, you guys probably don't know what that is if you're American, but actually, I don't, I don't, actually, I don't know if that's true or not. But you know, people in Britain, all right, we we
just like melts. Oh, it's, it's actually just so good, you know, like, oh my god, 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 oh, please don't die again. How am I not dead? I say that and then I die. I say that and then I die, bro. Honestly, I'm actually so dog shit at this game. Obviously, I could just use my specialist to get out, but as I said, I don't want to allow myself to use a specialist because I think it's a little bit OP. Oh, these zombies are messing me up, though. I ain't gonna lie. I need to get a shield. Oh my god, oh my god. Obviously, the thing is, I'm out of uh, quick revives now, or self revives, as they call it in this game, so I'll be careful, bro. I'll be catching the smoke like this. Right, we're on to round 16. Honestly, I don't know how much longer we've really got in us. It's getting difficult, bro. I ain't gonna lie. It's so difficult. I'm gonna pop me another piece of air remember. All right, I'm gonna go rebuy back quick revive. So quick revive is like actually essential in this game. It's so good. Oh my god, am I actually gonna die? Uh, it wasn't that good to save me. That's actually annoying. All right, well, good to round 16. Ignore this little you survive 15 round thing. All right, that doesn't, that just, that just doesn't count. But round 16 we got to. All right, I'm happy with that. Uh, let's move on to our next game, which is Black Ops Cold War. And then, boys, so on to Cold War. Originally, I was gonna do Mao the Totem, but uh, I'm saving Mao for another video that's gonna come out uh, at some point this week. So I switched to Firebase Z. This map is is pretty hated. I won't lie. And to be honest, I don't actually think I've ever even hit the box a single time on this map. Like this cheeky little hop. Okay, I'm, I'm failing it. Watch this. Watch this. Yo, oh, bro. Like honestly, the first try, I wasn't even sweating about it. But where is the box? The box is just over here. So we just open up this door, and here it is, boys. So we can start uh, hitting the box. Hopefully this round. All right. So we have 995. Let's just go ahead and hit the box. See what we get, and we get the lapper. I've never even heard of this gun in my life. But you know, this is what we're stuck with. It's kind of annoying. Is the size are actually better than this lapper? They actually got like purple rarity. This is some poopy little green gun. All right. So that's another thousand points. Let's go ahead and hit the box again. See what I get. Hopefully we get something decent. I don't think the Reagan's in this, but we got the the Howa. Okay, Howa is actually really good, so I'm happy with that. I think we've got some some decent guns, I guess. I don't know how good the Lapper is. I've never even used it. Looks like a little B Tech for Moss. I ain't gonna lie. Yo, actually, it looks like the USAS shotgun from like the Modern Warfare stuff, except it's not a shotgun. It's an SMG. All right, now we just gotta get set up. So I'm gonna start activating all these ether reactors. Open up this door here. Make my way down here. Start this little bad boy up. These zombies taking proper long. Like speed up, boys. All right, there we go. That's our ether reactor done. Uh, so we got two more to go. Then we'll be able to get like perks and be able to like pack and stuff like that so all right there we go that's the second one done actually making plays boys i'm gonna mimic bro yo get out of here little boy don't know me bro this how a shotgun just messed you up yeah, hopefully this won't take super long but this lapper is already falling off though like it's around six how are you already falling off all right well there you go that's that done so i'm gonna buy jug actually before we go all right so i just made my way down here okay here goes so pack punch is open we've now got the big bad boy perks do i want to pack punch or do i want to try and get perks i don't know let's pick it up a little bit you know we make it out of these ends uh do i want to just pack a punch i think i'm just gonna pack a punch this lapper hopefully it becomes actually usable okay it's a bit stronger now see if i can find some at the camp i might just whack on the uh rampage inducer see if we can speed through these rounds make it a little bit more interesting you know i haven't like had armor or anything yet it's criminal boys probably one of these zombies drop me some armor soon bro because like don't want to buy any armor i'm a little cheapskate like that but if the game's not going to drop me some i might have to like bro i can't put on the rampage inducer without any armor i'll actually just die it collapsed in seconds all right i'm gonna pack much this hour but this thing upgrade just one bullet at a time even though it's upgraded that's crazy all right let me buy uh speed cola kind of needed to upgrade these weapons like like reload them quicker like, yeah like, that's a bit more better now all right i'm just gonna have to be the big boy and i'm gonna have to put on the rampage and do so honestly i'm just getting fed up waiting for the zombies it's actually taking so long also we just got us some armor look at that didn't even have to pay for it a little cheapskate again there's nowhere really like to sit and just kind of like camp up like d machine has like a pretty obvious spot this is just like nothing you just gotta fight for your own here boys oh yeah that's right step back so the only thing with this lap right it just has no ammo like i keep running out like in the mag i mean like not actual like you, you know you know what i mean i right, should have right, i'm gonna buy quick revive by stamina up. Oh my god. But I'm out, you bro. You guys aren't catching me now. It's actually getting intense, bro. Right, there you go. That should be the end of the round. There you go. Round 13. We're making it, boys. We're making it. Pick up this double points. Get us some points, boys. I need to really pack a bunch of my gun again. It's like it's already started to like really drop off. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're trying to catch me in the corner, bro. Trying to get trolled out here. This is last guys. That'll be round 14. Defend the Epo yet off. I forgot about that whole challenge. Wait, I really think I should be turning off the rampage and do so before this. I, I ain't gonna have time, boys. Actually, I think I might have time. Oh shit, I should have done it. <laughs> Dude, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this, you know, with like these weapons i just think that they're, they're, they're not gonna cut it boys now we're gonna napalm put a strike dude i'm so fucked oh here they come bro yo no they're on their way yo, step back step back bro i got me a howard shotgun you don't even know me bro i am not beating this bro go i'm putting the napalm down i'm putting the napalm down dude, look how damaged it is already bro oh my god bro there's so many zombies back up bro back away from it back away from it i'm popping this ring of fire yo back away dude, where are they going what are you guys doing over here bro go away right, is that it bro that was actually squeaky bro right, i think that was it i didn't get a max ammo or anything for it so we got from a zombie anyways don't even need that whether the game's gonna drop me i don't know you pity points oh my god dude they died that nuke came in it's huge all right uh we can upgrade a weapon to the second tier i don't know which oh my god honestly i think i might have to do this lapper because dude this howler i don't know what it is about it but it kind of just sucks bro might need to re-roll the attachments on it but yeah for now like dude i'm, I'm grading this lapper bro oh my god oh my god dude why did i die how did i die hey, hold on i can get killed maybe oh, i get no kill bro these guys just they don't want anything to do with me all right there we go with the kill 
Okay, we got the kill. All right, this lap is going in, bro. We're going in. Do I need to get my whole armor back? I could just turn off the rampage inducer, but honestly, I'm, I'm committed now. All right, let's head in here. Let's buy me the level three armor and let's re roll these attachments. Yeah, I don't think that actually did anything, bro. All right, let's grab this max ammo here. Just walk into it, you know. Moonwalk into it. What can I say? Call me Michael Jackson, bro. Michael Jackson in the building, bro. You don't even know me. All right, I think this should be the end of the round. So let's go ahead and kill that guy. Run over here. I'm also going to increase the uh, rarity of this uh, weapon. And if I can, I want to re roll the attachments on this, but it's just not doing anything. All right, re roll it again. Like, it's just, it's not re rolling it, bro. I mean, scam. I got scammed out of all of my, uh, my shitty salvage. I can't remember what it's called now. All right, I think it's the end of this round as well. So that'll be round 19. Buy me back some more perks. And we'll get us some armor as well. So we're looking good, boys. We're looking good. Oh, dude, that's a mimic, bro. You already know it's a mimic. He thinks he controlled me. To be fair, I'm looking for a load of high grade salvage so I can upgrade this weapon more. Because eventually this thing will, like, drop off really hard. All right, there we go. Okay, so we got another wave assault coming. Wave assault, I mean, assault wave. Uh, bro, I don't know. We got another defend thing. <laughs> I can't speak. I got no English skills. I already know this. All right, we got a free artillery strike. Hopefully, it's better than napalm strike. I did nothing last time. All right, they're coming, boys. They're coming the zombies. Probably shouldn't have used my ring of fire up because I've got to try and do this by hand. You know, no, I don't even have to do it by hand. Napalm strike about to go in, bro. You don't understand. Watch. The kills it just got there. Like, like two kills. It'd yeah, be jealous, bro. But that artillery strike was actually the most pointless thing I've ever done in my entire life. All right, I'm going to pop ring of fire. I'm popping ring of fire, right? They ain't getting past me today. Well, these zombies think they're quirky, right? They think they're him. I'm going to teach him who's, who's really messing about. You know what? That one went a lot better. Oh, what? There's another one here. Okay, well, I guess I'll take that. I think that might be from the last one. I didn't think it was. I thought it would have despawned by now, but you know, I guess not. Game just felt like being a bit generous. All right, let's get back to uh, our little spot. Grab me just double points here. We're going to go to the town. We're about to get so many points. I'm about to be rich. I sit here, pop my ring of fire, go in on these little mimics. Oh my god, okay, we're actually getting kind of domed here. But back up, zombies. Back up. Where am I getting shot from? All right, let's take out this mangler. Here we go, boys. Round 22. Uh, I don't think I'm going to bother buying any more perks. I think I'm just going to try and save up the level 3 upgrade because I'm in like 7,000 points away. Oh my god, oh my god. No, 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 no. Get me out of here, bro. Get me out of here. Yo, that was not right, bro. Oh, what? I come up. I don't know how I did it, but I got back. Well, I guess there goes all the points I was going to save up. And we're back down to nothing. Oh, well, either way, we're on round 23. These weapons are definitely starting to get weak. I ain't gonna lie. Like, Ring of Fire is kind of carrying me right now. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, dude, I'm one tap again. I don't want to die. This game, don't do me in the bum like this, up, please. All right, let's just go in, boys. Let's go in. Oh my god, these guns are actually so weak now. We're on to round 24. I'm gonna buy me back some, some armor. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Dude, this Ring of Fire ain't doing it, bro. This Ring of Fire ain't it. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're gonna die. Dude, we managed to get out of that somehow. Holy. All right, pick up uh, insta kill. Go to town, bro. Yeah, I think we're coming up on the end of the round. There we go. All right, round 25. How are we gonna get around 30? That's the real question. I honestly thought the howl would be what's uh, what would carry us through this challenge, but nah, bro. This lap has been in a in a, like in a shift, bro. I ain't gonna lie. For a level two pack punch weapon, it's not doing us too bad. Yeah, let's get this ring of fire on the go. Oh my god, how'd I die? Okay, well, we're somehow back up. But always when I like I get 30k points that are down, so I have to rebuy all my perks. You know what? I'm not even gonna do it this time, game. You can't make me. I'm gonna get my level three pack punch, and you can't stop me. All right, we're on to round 26, anyways. Now that we actually have like a max out weapon. Oh my god, dude, I might be dying already. Yeah, but as I say, now that we have a max out weapon, that hopefully won't do as bad. But right there, kind of just nearly debunked me. This gun is still bad. It's just like a bit better now. It's just a bit more tolerable, a bit more manageable. All right, ring of fire, boys. I'm not hoping we could get round 30, but boys, I'll be honest, I, I just don't know. All right, round 27. Let's see if we can quickly buy some of our perks back. To be fair, I can increase my uh, weapon rarity with some of the salvage I picked up. So I'll do that at the end of this round. Oh my god, oh my god. If I make it to the end of this round, holy. Back off, dog. Dude, I'm just having to run the same train. Look, all right, so basically, I just come over here. I start shooting all zombies down here, right? I start mowing them through, all right? And then I have to make my way up here through this window, like I think I'm like James Bond or something, not get trapped, make my way back over here, and I'd have to shoot again, but I'm just gonna grab this nuke, you know? It'd be that hassle, you know? All right, let's increase our rarity to purple, and we need a thousand to get it to the, uh, to the final one. Hopefully, I'll be able to do. All right, last eye is this mangler. I think he's funny, bro. Oh, back off, bro. Back off. This tower is so bad. How has it not killed him yet? Like, bro, kill him, bro. All right, I'm gonna train all these zombies up, and I'm gonna pop my ring of fire, and then just go in. So, we got this pop it now. Let's go in, boys. Let's take out the, the manglers, bro. That's my issue. I'm just gonna keep shooting, bro. I'm just gonna keep shooting. An insta kill there as well. So, after string of fire runs out, we can quickly grab that. Just keep going, boys. Mangler thinks he's trolling me. I say Mangler, I mean Mimic, but look, when I'm, I'm concentrating this hard, you know, like being a real pro gamer, you know, put me in the esports of COD Zombies. Like, boys, I just, I have to drop a language, you know. All right, well, there you go. That's round 29. We're actually making it, bro. Uh, also, I'm going to make my life easier. I'm going to buy Deadshot. Because uh, Deadshot should increase my multipliers at the head. So hopefully that'll help quite a bit. Yeah, look at these critical kills. Yeah, that is very helpful. I right, pop Ring of Fire. And we just go to town, boys. You know what it is. All right, this last guy. And I think that'll put us to round 30. Oh, this is not last guy. This is definitely not last guy. There's a few more over here. Right, there we go. That's last guy. So we're on to round 30 now. I kind of want to try and upgrade this tower, but honestly, it's just, I just don't think it's going to be good. Like, even if I upgrade it, I'll put a ring of fire here. Let's go to town, boys. Oh my god,
So I'm just going to go over here and we're going to exfil out of here. Right? I'm done with this map. It's been going on for too long. All right, let's hop over this fence, you know. All right, so we're into the area. All I got to do is get 54 kills. Actually, easy stuff, bro. I'm not even sweating about it. Ideally, I could get a ring of fire, you know, and make my life a little bit easier. But overall, I think we'll be fine, boys. But either way, we got the ring of fire. So let's just pop that real quick. All right, there we go. We're coming up on the last few hostiles. Only one guy left. Where's he at? Where's he at? Oh, here he is. All right, bro. I'm going to take out the Howard's little bookie little weapon. All right, he, he got turned. But you no, know, I guess he's he coming on with us, bro. You're he, joining us. Hop on, bro. Hop on the helicopter. All right, bro. There we go. All right, we managed to exfil around 31. Honestly, Cold War, a little bit too easy, bro. So, you know, had to end it somehow. Uh, but yeah, other than that, we'll move on to our final game, which is uh, Call of Duty Vanguard. And then, boys, and on to our final game, we have Vanguard. Now, we're doing Sheena Duma because, let's be real, like, this is the only real good map in this game. <laughs> like, it's the only one, it's one of the only two round based maps in this entire game as well. So, not really, like, spoiled for options. Oh, what is going on? What's going on with the zombies, bro? What? What? My game's lagging. How's my game lagging? I'm playing solo, bro. I've had this issue before. I'm lagging and I'm playing solo. All right, well, either way, the box isn't even here. Where is the box? Is the box up here? Like, where is the box? Oh, it's here. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and hit it and see what we get. It's our first gun, boys, and we got the the rat. The rat, bro. What is this gun, bro? I got the Sivo HD pistol. What is this, bro? This gun is so cheeks. Bro, I better get something really good or I swear to God, I'm not going to be happy. Bro, this gun is so bad. It's already nearly out of ammo. All right, let's hit the box. Hopefully, we get like a good second one. All right, we got the MG42. All right, you know, that'll do, boys. <laughs> this shitty little rat pistol. I actually can't believe we got a shitty little pistol. All right, well, basically, it's a one hit challenge because, bro, I don't think I'm going to be using this a whole lot throughout this game. Oh, look at this, bro. It's already out of ammo. All right, let's just switch this MG42. Actually, you know, ooh, some zombies. All right, let's make our way in here. We can start getting some upgrades. Your weapon deals more damage the faster you move. Well, like, I mean, I guess I guess we'll get that. I don't really know how this works. I guess we're going to have to get stamina up like ASAP. All right, I think I can open up here. No, I can't. How many points about 60 points, bro. You know what? I can't even read about the barrier because they don't exist in this game. All right, we've got a little like, explodey zombie round. I think they're proper funny. They can, they can sneak up on me. Good little bro. All right, so now we have access to pack a punch. So we can actually start upgrading our weapons and stuff. And see, I don't know what it is about like Cold War and Vanguard and stuff like that, but they just, just suck, bro. Like, they actually do feel like a chore to play compared to the other games. Like, be free, right? You just get your weapons, you pack a punch at once, get like 5,000 points. You want a double upgrade, you can get a double upgrade. That's up to you. Perks all are set at, you know, a set price. In Cold War, right? It's like, you've got to upgrade your gun three times, 30,000 points. You've got to get all your perks. They go up in am uh, price every single time you buy one. It's just like, it's such a chore, bro. And this game just like double down on it. Being like, oh yeah, you can buy each of the perks the first time for free, but then you've got to start paying ridiculous prices for it. And the pack a punch costs more. It's just, everything just costs so much in these new games. Games. Like, I actually don't like them. Also, this gun is already sucking, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. Alright, I'm only like 800 points away from getting uh, a pack a punch on this gun. Oh my god, bro. Alright, let's go ahead and upgrade this weapon. Barracuda F U all. I think this is the same weapon as it was in World of War, is it not? Might be mistaken about that, but either way, we're going on to round eight. This gun still doesn't really feel that good. You know, even though it's like pack a punch, it feels low key kind of cheeks. I ain't gonna lie. Alright, let's go ahead and buy speed cola. I'm gonna buy it. Oh, I was gonna buy it twice, but it costs so much fucking money, bro. Money I don't have. Right, let's buy it twice. Bro, I need to get stamina up like as soon as possible to be honest so there we go all right we finally got sp uh, stamina up all right we got another explodey zombie round okay i'm gonna buy the second version of stamina up. okay this double point's actually kind of massive as well because it's quite a bit of points oh my god dude. oh my god i'm gonna die bro yo back off zombies they're trying to catch me slipping all right you know what i'll pack a bunch of the rat i still see how it does <laughs> shit actually it's not as bad actually as i thought it would be much of the rat is what saves us this entire like run this rat's going to town bro this rat's actually kind of like can i carry it okay i'll say that as i'm about to die oh my god dude how'd i die all right we already lost ourselves Buy. That's kind of an L. That's right. I need to buy me uh, my armor because I forgot it never drops in this game. Oh my god. Oh, well, there goes all of my upgrades and my plugs. I actually hate this game, bro. <laughs> anyway, let's buy ourselves some armor. Honestly, I'm thinking about this X filling around 15 and just calling it a day, bro. Honestly, let's be real. I, I don't want to see Vanguard. You guys don't want to see Vanguard. Honestly, I'm too fat. I actually might buy it before then. These guns are cheeks, bro. All right, we're on to around 14. Maybe I'll go to 20. All right, maybe I'll get a little bit more out of this video. Oh my god. Okay, we are like actually one tap. These guns are just so weak, bro. That's why I always just stick to the starting shot. Actually, the best weapon in the game. I always on low. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna exfil now. Low key getting annoyed at this game, so let's just get an exfil on the go. Alright, let's go in, boys. We only need 47 kills. Alright, I think we can do it. But I mainly need these zombies to speed up, bro. They're actually mad slow. When this guy is just taking it like a tank, bro. Oh my god, I forgot there's a little witch, isn't there? Alright, we're popping uh, Aether Shroud. Where's she gone? Oh, she's vanished. Where's she go? Here she is. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here, little boy. Yeah, you're gone. There's a second one. I thought, oh my god. No, it's not a second one. She's still alive. Okay. Oh my god, bro. Okay, we're about halfway through. These zombies are so slow. I ain't even gonna lie. A two box challenge, but I'm gonna use our monkey bomb, honestly. I'm getting annoyed now. Oh, he's okay. He just he, he just he doesn't play by the rules. He does not play by the rules. You know what? Honestly, good riddance, bro. They're saying objective failed, bro. I'm saying objective succeeded, bro. I get off this game. Objective complete. I get the F4 this shitty game. But alright, that's the end of this video. Honestly, it was a lot harder than I thought it was
trying to hit uh, 20k by the end of this month. Honestly, boys, I don't think I'm going to do it. But if you guys can help me and we do get there, I'll be very happy. All right. And I might do a big stream plan for it. So I don't know. But yeah, other than that, guys, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.